G'day everybody, Scott from King & Heath Real Estate in Painesville here. I'm standing on a magnificent property in Eagle Point. It is on the famous Mitchell River on the Gibson Lakes. The property address is 200 Rivermouth Road. We're on about 14 and a half acres, two storey home, uh, two full kitchens, shedding, paddocks, jetty berth to the Mitchell River. We've got the lake as you can see in the background to our east. The Mitchell River is to our west, and let's go for a tour. Okay, we're about to enter inside. We're just uh, at the downstairs carport at the moment. I'll just give you a quick scan around, and then we'll head inside, do the downstairs section, and then we'll head upstairs. All right. We'll go in the door. Sorry about my reflection there, up the steps. Hopefully I won't trip down. That's the uh, stairs to upstairs. I'm just gonna head into the downstairs section to give you a bit of an understanding of that. That's our, car, um, our um, laundry through there. Turn left. This is the downstairs living area, which is kitchen, meals, and sitting area. It's got a double, it's got a sliding door there that takes you outside. As you can see the lake in the background. We'll just have a quick scan. There's an air conditioner. Good size room this is, really good size. There's a wood fire, ceiling fan. We'll have a quick look at the kitchen. It's got all the stuff that you need in a kitchen. Fridge space, oven gas cooktop which is on bottles it's nice we'll head back down the hallway down to the bedroom section and we'll have a quick squeeze at the bathroom and then we'll move upstairs don't want to try and hold you too long hopefully i won't uh, trip up there's another sliding door there out to the carport we've got a a single bedroom here which actually I've called a study so that's there which is good nice and bright lovely day on the lakes today it's gonna to be about 29 we're heading into summer and it's been fantastic been catching a bit of fish a few fish on the river which is good there's another bedroom We've got some robes, we'll just scan around, have a quick look at the other bedroom. Yep, it's got some robes as well, which is handy. Plenty of cupboard space in the property. We'll just head out into the central foyer. We'll quickly head into the bathroom. One of the lights are flickering, so you'll have to excuse me there. Downstairs section, which is like a laundry bathroom. The shower's behind the door, separate loo, and then we're heading to the main laundry, which has got a door outside and heaps of storage space. Let's head upstairs. All right. Okay, we're upstairs uh, at the moment on the balcony from the lounge room. And as you can see, it gets a magnificent view of the lake. It's a beautiful day, hardly a breath of wind. Um, truly a picturesque day for the Gippsland Lakes today. This is actually quite a big balcony actually. So this is very usable. Uh, it's on the east side, so you get all the morning sun. We'll head through the, the double doors into the living area. You can see the wood fire there. Just poke inside. This is a big room. So this is like lounge, dining area probably, which leads to the kitchen. There's your split system. You can see the big dining table. To my right there, as you see, just over there, that's the, that, Brick area is the staircase that leads you upstairs. There you go. We'll head into the kitchen now, which is a newish kitchen done not that long ago. 
That cupboard there is the um, pantry. Great kitchen, gas cooktop, range hood. There's your dishwasher. If you like doing dishes, which most of us don't, there's a great view from the window outside. Head to the bedroom section now. So I'm in the main bedroom. So there's a dressing area there. Plenty of um, plenty of storage space. As you can see, it's quite a big room at this end. There's another balcony with fantastic views that, that shows you the lakes. We've got our bathroom in here, which you can see through there. Office area up in the bedroom, which is handy. Nice view out to the garden. And then there is another bedroom here. So it'd be fantastic, like family with young kids or something like that. That's fantastic. All right, I'm gonna take you out to the shed. So I'm just gonna give you a quick look outside. Just a quick one. We'll have a quick look at the, there's the front paddock, some fruit trees and so forth there. And then if we scan over, you'll see that there's shedding and all that over there, which is quite a big shed. It's got a fair bit of stuff in it and it's a great shed. Then we'll just head to my left and I'll probably cut it in a second and we'll, um, and we'll go and have a quick scan of the water and we'll call it quits. Right, let's go and have a look at the water. We're on the downstairs outdoor living area off the kitchen meals area downstairs, of course, as I just said. And we'll uh, go for a bit of a wander out from here down to the water to show you how close it is. Here are the chooks in the background. Sort of clouding up a little bit today, but there's no, no breeze. There's a tiny breeze and it's probably an easterly really today. And the water looks unbelievable. So you'll see, there's one of the paddocks there. You can see the tin shed there. There's a water trough in that background. The, the boundary fence is actually just to, to the right of that. I'll do a quick scan around, which we're all on the, the property. And then where the tree line is in the background there, that is the boundary. There's a water trough. And it just gives you a great understanding of 200 Rivermouth Road. Thanks for looking at the video. Have a great day.